Happy Tuesday, Northern Michigan, and a Merry Christmas Eve to you. Now, we have seen a lot of sunshine out there today. However, hopefully you enjoyed it because it is going to change. Here's a current look at radar. Not a but if I zoom out, our next system is quickly on its way. See the line of snow showers through Minnesota here? This is our next system. It's an Alberta Clipper, so it's a fast-moving low-pressure system. Going to move through quickly to the north of us through Canada and give us a little bit of snowfall, just ensuring us that we do have a white Christmas. Here's a look at Stormcast. So hopefully you got errands and such done earlier today because heading overnight tonight, we start to see cloud cover increase and we start to see our next round of snow make its way in late night tonight. We're talking one to three o'clock in the morning. It'll spread across the area, becomes a little bit more scattered by the time that we enter mid morning. So that's some good news. And then as we head later on throughout our afternoon hours, here comes another round as we approach dinner time. Definitely be careful if you are headed out traveling at all throughout your Christmas holiday, because we are going to see winds increase throughout the day, could be gusting up to about mid thirties out of the south. So it will create some drifts, snow covered roads, and some low visibilities at times. Now heading later on into West Wednesday evening here. Those snow showers do continue to push their way out of the area. We do see lake effect start to kick in though as we head late night uh, on Wednesday into Thursday morning. And throughout the entire day on Thursday, northwestern lower and also parts of the eastern UP going to see some more accumulating snow showers and that will continue very scattered as we head into Friday morning also. Here's a look at those snowfall totals. Now heading overnight into Wednesday morning, we start to see that system approach. So by 8 o'clock Wednesday morning, some of us in the eastern UP, also on the Lake Michigan side towards inland areas, looking at about one to three inches possible. And then as we head throughout the day on Wednesday, we look to pick up more. Now, I think this model is underestimating a little bit for the lake effect areas. Could be picking up about four to eight inches by Wednesday evening throughout the entire day on Wednesday. So again, keep that in mind if you are going to be traveling. Here's a look at your seven day forecast, and we are going to see that chance of snow linger as we head throughout the next upcoming week. We are going to keep temperatures mainly in the 20s, a little bit warmer there as we head into Saturday. We we'll cool right back down heading into the next upcoming work week. Thanks for clicking at upnorthlive.com.